Stephen King fans, get ready. Maine's best-known author is hitting the small screen tomorrow night right here on CBS 13. King is the executive producer of a new miniseries based on his most recent bestseller. And as CBS 13's Kim Block tells us, people in one Maine town simply can't wait. It is one of the most highly anticipated television shows of the summer, Under the Dome, based on the best-selling book by Maine's own Stephen King. Get people trapped in here! Mainers will be watching closely. That's because the science fiction thriller is based in a place known as Chester's Mill, which seems an awful lot like another western Maine town. This is not Chester's Mill, Maine, but it's as close as you'll get. The town in Under the Dome is based on this community of Bridgeton, Maine. And for the locals, there is just no question about that. And, uh, you know, he just put everything, like the hospital and the diner. It's almost as if you are reading about our downtown when you're reading about Chester's Mill. Uh, the Food City grocery store was um, was in the mist and that's also in uh, under the dome and um, and if you look at the the roads he uses in the places um, you can see a lot of uh, Bridgeton in it. Stephen King himself says it's true. A former town resident he now lives nearby in Lovell but it was Bridgeton he chose for his first book signing when under the dome was released. That's where we asked him about his reference in the book to a CBS 13 helicopter that crashes into the dome and later explodes. The eye and logo is recognizable from a long way away and I saw uh, a CBS helicopter on the New York News and I said it's got to be WGAN. Well you're not WGAN anymore but you know 13. Though the names, either of people or streets, may have been changed, Bridgeton residents say the similarities are obvious, starting with the town newspaper and its former editor, Eula Shorey, who has many of the characteristics of Julia Shumway in Under the Dome. You think we might be stuck in here a while? He patterned her after Eula, her fierce determination and her, her principles and morals. The Bridgeton News is located in the town right where the Democrat is. People in Bridgeton say they expect things will look different. Background action! With a series shot in North Carolina, and they've heard the writers have taken some liberties with the script, even the ending. Still, I think that I know this town well enough that I'm going to be able to sense if there's anything that reminds me of, of here immediately, it, it will come to me. And they know there's a reason King chose Bridgeton as his starting point for a volume that runs over a thousand pages. Well, it's like he said to me, it's like, it's like small town USA, and he said he knew the geography backhanded, so it was such a big book, uh, so many characters, he wanted something that he didn't even have to think about where things were. He could just concentrate on the story and the characters. And when he's done with all the media attention, he'll come home to Bridgeton, where they will do what they have always done, protect his privacy under their dome. In Bridgeton, Kim Block, CBS 13 News. And if you're as excited as we are, you don't have to wait long. Under the Dome, a 13-week miniseries begins tomorrow night at 10, right here on CBS 13.